Hi guys, Mrs. Cam's here. Welcome and welcome back to the channel. I know, I know, I know, I know. I've been gone forever. I do it all the time. I say I'm gonna start doing more videos and then I do one video and then I disappear. In my defense, I've had a lot going on. As y'all know, um, we have been building our house. We are finally moved in. And I'm gonna give you guys what y'all wanted, which is a house tour. But anyway, if you're following me on Instagram, then you've already seen a lot of the house because I have been posting like, um, like Instagram reels and photos and stuff. So if you're not following me on Instagram, then you need to go ahead and make sure you're following me. I'll have my um, Instagram linked below. Anyway, enough rambling. Let's um, get you guys what y'all came here for. Welcome to my crib. And I'm also recording with my cell phone because my camera is tripping and um, yeah, I don't know what's going on. Okay, so we are in the entryway and off to the left, um, we have our office or study, whatever you want to call it. It has um, double glass doors and then walking in, we have a floor to ceiling cabinets. And then on this side over here is my side. And then that is my husband's side over there. He is supposed to be working, but I guess he's on break right now. And then we have this big, huge window here that lets so much light in. If it gets too bright, we do have um, the motorized shades that come down. But yeah, so this is our office. If you see blue tape, that's because they are still out here fixing stuff and doing touch-up paint and stuff like that. And we have a TV in here. And then over there, my little dog's bed because he likes to hang out in here with us when we're working. So this is our office. And then right here, we have the entryway table. Um, not sure what to do with the wall above it. I might either do a mirror or, I don't know, maybe a nice um, artwork. Just let me know what you guys think. This table is from a furniture store called Our House. Pretty much all my furniture is either Our House or Restoration Hardware. But yeah, absolutely love this table. It has lots of storage on the inside. Beautiful. Right here we have our wine room. Let's take a look. All right, so we also have floor to ceiling um, cabinets in here as well. And then we have our wine rack. And then we have some cabinets over there. And then here we have a wine fridge because this is uh, this room is not actually temperature controlled. So we do have to have a wine fridge to keep uh, whatever wine we're gonna drink, we'll just put it in the fridge and get it cold. Okay, and that is the wine room. And I just love how it is all glass, if you can tell. There's my little doggy. Okay. And then here, it's called a rotunda. It's just like a, a second entry. It's just like an opening, basically. Not sure what I'm gonna do with this area, if anything. And then we can go straight into the living room. So this is a living room. So over here, we have um, the floating shelves on both sides. We did black on the wall because there's so much white in here. We wanted to kind of break it up. And then we have um, the amazing, <laughs> okay, I'm tripping all over myself. Then we have the amazing fireplace right here. Okay, and then the furniture in here is also, like I said, pretty much everything is either from our house or restoration hardware. This is from our house, but I'm thinking that I'm going, well, actually not thinking. We, we are changing this out. Initially, I wanted a sectional because we had one in our old house, but I don't like how it blocks the view right there. So we're changing this. It's a custom order, so it's gonna take a while, but they're letting us keep this until um, the piece that we want actually comes in. So they have the best customer service, hands down. So we will have this for a while. So I'm just gonna do like just a sofa 
And then maybe two more chairs here just to keep the views open and not so closed. Right here, we just have the sliding glass door that slides all the way open. And then I'll give you a view from this side. That's the entryway. And this coffee table, it is so unique. This is um, from our house. It's like a big tree trunk or something like right here. And then around it is like metal. And then those chairs there, they're actually um, swivel chairs. And then here's a better view of the floating shelves. I have no idea what I'll be doing with that. I mean, I don't know. I am not the best when it comes to decorating. I'm good at finding furniture, but like decorating. And then in here we have vaulted ceilings. So um, this light fixture, it was not what the builder put in. We actually just changed it afterwards. But this is the living room. And then it's open to the kitchen. So this is the kitchen. Let me just back up so you can get a better view. Okay, so this is a kitchen. We have a huge island. And underneath the island, you probably can't see it, but um, those cabinets all open, but they do not have handles on them yet. So we have to get that done. And then we have our fridge. It is KitchenAid. All the appliances are KitchenAid. And then as you can tell, all the cabinets are floor to ceiling. And then we did the glass and they all have lights on the inside. Going into the kitchen. So this is our stove, also KitchenAid. It has two ovens on it. And then, oh, this is our spice rollout. It's a mess. Nope, not organized yet. It will be. And then we also have another oven there. So, and then the microwave. And then we have the pull out trash. And then I don't want to show you my sink because I actually have dishes in the sink, but the sink is there. And then another view of the kitchen. And then off the kitchen is our dining area. I'll take you there. But before I take you there, I want to take you back here because this is our, um, it's called a working pantry or a butler's pantry or like a little prep kitchen or whatever you want to call it. So we have floor to ceiling cabinets there um, and gold hardware like we had everywhere else. So I keep most of my appliances like here. We have another sink. We have another pull out trash. And then this is the actual pantry. It's a mess. I don't want to take you in here, but I'll give you a quick little peek. So it's a huge walk-in pantry, lots of space. Okay, that's it. It's embarrassing, but um, I do plan on getting like little baskets and like uh, the clear containers and doing all that. This is our dining which is off of the kitchen. The lighting is terrible right now. I'm trying to get you a good view. But yeah, so this is the dining and you have um, all the windows. You can see the backyard. And then we have double doors that go out to the patio. And here's a better view of the dining. Ooh, bright. And then that's our light fixture. And then open to the kitchen. And we did do um, a black island just to break up all the white. And since we are over here, I'll go ahead and take you down this hallway. So down this hallway, we have like um, two bedrooms, which are my kids' rooms. I will not take you in there because it's probably a mess and they do not... Um, they're private, they don't like their stuff to be like on display. So this is our game room. Um, we have a sectional in here. This was our old couch from the, the old house, so we just put it in here. 
I'll get a nice rug. And we're thinking like right here, this open area, we could do a pool table. I've been trying to find one. I just haven't found one yet. We have a TV in here. And then it's like um, huge windows, but we have the shades down because it gets um, really bright in here. And then we have like another sink, a beverage fridge, microwave. This will be like a little snack bar. I haven't gotten around to doing that yet, but I will. Then we have our media room. So our media room is furnished because um, we love to watch movies. So this room had to be done. So this is our media room. Okay, going back down this hallway. So we have these two bedrooms. Um, so there's bedrooms with bathrooms because all the bedrooms have their own bathrooms. Now we do have like a little powder bath here for like if anyone's over here or using the game room or whatever, they can just come out here and use this instead of having to go into like one of the bedrooms to use the bathroom or whatever. So we have a powder bath here and we did gray cabinets with gold hardware, gold mirror, and gold light fixtures. I'm going back down this hallway, I'll take you to our laundry room. Yep. So we basically did white, black, and gold. Those were the colors I was, um, I had on my uh, Pinterest board. Now this is the laundry room, which is right off the butler's pantry. I tried to do something different. So I did um, the gray and white checkered floors. So we have a ton of cabinets in here. And then I wanted to have like a little area where I can have like a little desk. So that will be my desk. Well, this is my desk right here. We have another sink in here. Okay, so now my dog wants to go crazy. Okay, sorry about that. My dog was having a fit. Anyway, so we have a sink here. We have another fridge here. And then we have our mud bench. And then a hanging rack. And then a washer and dryer. Another closet here is like a storage closet. Now this leads to the garage. But my garage is a mess. I don't want to show y'all, but I'll give you all a little peek. This is the garage. It's a four car garage. So there's two here and then two on the other side. But we have tons of boxes and stuff because we're still unpacking. But this is our laundry room. What do y'all think about the floor? Okay, so this hallway here leads us to a guest bedroom. So this is like a third, this is a third bedroom. This is a guest bedroom. So bright. Um, we do have the shades that come down if it gets too bright in here. So it was just um, nothing much, just a bed, nightstand. This is just a guest bedroom. No one's in this room. TV. And then, like I said, all the bedrooms have their own bathroom. So I'll show you this bathroom. Let me close this. I hate watching videos when they're showing the bathrooms and the toilet seat is up. Okay, so in this bathroom, initially we had um, like black faucets, but I hated how the black looked. So we changed the faucets to gold, changed the mirror to gold, and then our fixtures to black and gold. Well, the light fixture of black and gold. Mirror is gold, faucet's gold. I'm gonna change out that handlebar to gold. And then this is the shower. So this is the guest bathroom. Closet, it's just a closet, nothing to see here. It's a really big closet. Um, we're already putting junk in here. Okay. And coming away from there, we're going back down this hallway, living room again. So I'll take you over to the master bedroom. So just the hallway and it is not decorated. Not much has been done. Literally all we have in here is just a bed, which is a mess, disregard that. Um, 
in our nightstands. And look at the view from the bedroom. We have the best views. So yeah, just nightstands, a bed, my camera I was trying to fix, can't get it to work, don't know what's going on. We have our TV in here. And that's it. Look at my doggy. Hey, baby. Yeah, I don't know what to do with my bedroom. It's Right now it's just, it's just plain, but I'll definitely keep y'all posted with what I decide to do with it. Going into our bathroom. So this is the master bath. So we have, there, lighting is so much better. So we have um, double vanities on opposite sides. That's my husband's side. And then this is my side. So we did gold. And then we also have the gold hardware with the um, gray cabinets. And then we have our tub. And then this is our shower. Huge shower. And then we did like the double shower heads. Oh, but something really cool about our shower is that um, it's a smart shower. So we don't have like any handles or anything to turn the water on. We have to use this or you can use an app. I personally like to use the app on my phone. I can just go ahead and set my temperature and everything. I will show y'all, but I'm actually recording from my phone. Or you can just hit the button right there. But yeah, pretty cool. Now, if something happens to that, I don't know how we're gonna turn the water on. Yeah. So that is my shower. So this is just our toilet water room or whatever you want to call it and then this is a linen closet which it's a mess i'm not going to show you okay so then we have the closet so what i love most about this closet is that i wanted to have like a dedicated area where i could like sit and do my makeup my hair or just whatever so i had this vanity built our closet was done by california closet they did an amazing job. So I have like all these drawers down here, tons of storage. And then we also have tons of storage up there because I wanted to have lots of storage. And then I have like a light here for extra lighting. I did the glass fronts. So this is where I sit and do my makeup hair, just whatever, okay? And then on this side, okay, so in here, we also did floor to ceiling again. So this is my husband's side of like lots of um, drawer space. And then um, we have a hamper right here for like dirty clothes or whatever. So yeah, this is my husband's side. And then obviously I had the bigger side, but yeah, floor to ceiling. So don't look at how it's organized because it's work in progress. I'm tr still trying to unbox, unpack stuff, but I kind of have to start putting stuff in here and I'll figure it all out later. Then I have this right here for like my purses and everything. And it also has the lights. I wanted to make sure that I had somewhere to put my jewelry. So we did the jewelry trays right here. I have tons of drawer space. So with both of us working from home, we don't really have a, like a lot of like, I don't know, like office clothes and, or like stuff like that. We just have tons of like sweats because we're at home all the time. So we need more drawer space than hanging space, but there's still quite a bit of space in here. And then on my side, it goes all the way down to the end. But yeah, I still have lots of space. I still have lots of stuff to unbox. So, yeah. Still all a work in progress. I really wanted to have like an island in the middle, but the space was just too narrow for that. So, this was my version of an island. Let me know what you think, guys. So, this is the closet. And that is my vanity. 
All right, so you've pretty much seen everything. Like I said, I have a lot to decorate. I have a lot to do, and I will take you guys along this journey with me. So yeah, this is my home. Finally, we are moved in. We have been here, I wanna say about two weeks now. So yeah, just getting used to everything. Oh, let me take you outside. Hold on, okay. So, these are the big double doors to take you out to the patio. Oh, it's bright. We do have an outdoor fireplace on the patio. And they just installed this yesterday. So this is actually a sports court. It's gonna be basketball and then um, pickleball. So we're waiting for them to come install the basketball hoop. They came by today and left us the, the net for the pickleball. But yeah, our neighborhood is pretty much all new construction. Well, it is all new construction. Most of these houses, no one even lives there yet. They're still being built. They're almost finished. Our yard is huge. Eventually, we're gonna have a pool right here. It is so bright out here. It goes into our dining area. And there's my dog again. Aww. It is so hot outside. This is our dining area kitchen, living room. All right, guys, that's it. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Bye.